Hey, just another piece of advice. Before you go to get the other car, just go into your house and get some health. It's kind of it's kind of something you don't think about, but it really does help. So you don't have to bother looking for health later. Okay now, in part two, just make sure that your car's in the garage, like that, that's fine. Now, all we have to do is drive back to that apartment complex, which which are to gardens. So, just drive back normally, and I'm just, yep. Yeah. Okay, once you're at which are to gardens, you have to go to the other car, which will be the original car you've dented, which is here. Now get in this car and ditch this exactly the same way as the, the, as the first car you ditched. So you just, yep, yeah, steal it. Go to the finger. Just, yep. Yeah. Drive about there. Get out so you don't lose too much health drowning. Yeah. Get yeah, yeah tax will do. Yep. <clears throat> and remember to make it float on the water, otherwise you'll lose you you you'll lose the protection of the car forever. It will never be um, indestructible. So be careful not to mess this up, or else you'll have to redo the whole mission again if you want to have two indestructible cars. God, can't believe that's still not floating. Damn. Okay, that's now floating. Now, you do the same thing. You go back and kill everyone. But, actually, do not kill everyone. Leave the last guy remaining alive. Because there is a new kind of thing you got to be careful about. <laughs> what the heck? Glitch. Ah, idiot. What the heck are these guys? Hmm. Weirdos. Okay, now this is the last guy. Now you have to lure him out into the open. If you kill him from here, the car will vanish. So this may bore you to death, but it's the only thing you can do. Just walk a natural pace. Just get a car and let him follow you. Come on. Where we're going. Come on. Slow can people run. Come on. Come on. Move. Yep, so you have to lure him as close to the car as possible, just to be on the safe side. So I'll lure him across this road. Actually, from here, you can probably drive. Just drive all the way to the car, and he'll probably drown himself, so... Yep, thought so. Now, just drive the car out of the water, and it's hit or miss now, if it's um, got its armour. It depends if it was destroyed in the water, so you have to, you have to test it 
afterwards and if it's not um, bulletproof then bad luck you know that's that's terrible so now I just have to drive this car out okay right now you have your car now is the final test hopefully it should be bulletproof if not then you have to do this again I'm really sorry please no smoke yes brilliant now you just drive this back to the safe house okay now when you're at your safe house you can very proudly drive the final car in now you have two identical indestructible invincible Ferrelli excess cars so if you've got these two now you should feel proud that's one hell of an achievement two indestructible cars now with those cars you can do anything you could get a tank even just by causing mayhem because the car can't be destroyed so anyway i hope this video has been a big help if it is you know let let me know and um you know if you have any problems just ask you know ask some queries or something but anyway thanks very much for watching